This is the new Chameleon EVF from Zacuto. Cinema 5D at NAB 2019 is brought to you by B&H, the professional source for all your video needs. CVP, the leading specialist in creative cine, video, and photo solutions. Gudson, capture the world. Cartoni, supports your vision. And SERP, better films. Hey guys, Grant Mailer Sheldon here from Cinema5D.com. We're at NAB 2019 and I'm in the Zakuda booth right now uh, with Verge. So Verge, uh, we heard maybe a couple weeks ago about the Chameleon EVF. We announced it on the site and you now have one in your hands. So tell me a little bit about it. So this is our, our latest addition to our EVF line. Uh, major things here, HDMI input up to 4K, also has uh, SDI input, so it's a combination of both. So if you're looking for that smaller form factor, but you need, you know, the thing is it's like a tool. It, different cameras have different outputs, so this gives you a wider range of what you're able to use it with. This is not you know, a camera-specific viewfinder. It'll work on pretty much anything that's out there. Very cool. Yep, smaller form factor still has our great eye cup. Uh, colors are rich. Uh, all the different features that you're used to from Zacuto, the sharpness is there, um, and it just makes it easier for you to be able to pull focus and see what you need to see, which is uh, very important when you're out in the field. Yeah, of course. And um, obviously, all the the features that you're used to seeing from Zacuto, you just mentioned. So, which begs a question. It says powered by JTZ. So, can you explain that relationship a little bit to yeah. us here? So we came across JTZ and uh, Stephen Yens, you know, the owners of, of Zacuto, loved them. They got along with them. And we found that they were making uh, a great product, and we felt that we could add to that and just uh, you know do some software tweaks and do some different things and make it uh, an even greater product. And it, uh, we decided to partner with them, and that's how we got here with this chameleon now. Cool, can you, can you be a little more specific about the relationship? Like which part is the Zakuda part and then which part is the, Z, uh, the JTZ part? So the, the basic uh, you know, panel and all that is still the JTZ, what started with the form factor they came up with. We've added the iCup, our anti-fog uh, system that really helps you out when you're on your field. And then a lot of the software tweaks as far as just how the color is handled and how it's displayed and what you can see uh, and, and the sharpening of the focus is stuff that we added. Okay, and then where do you see the Chameleon fitting, uh, I, I believe you at least two other EVFs beyond the Chameleon as well. The Gradical HD, which is my, kind of our original, um, that does, you know, um, still out there, still working strong and going strong. We have the Gradical I, uh, which is a smaller form factor, and then we have the Chameleon now. And uh, it's really, you know, a lot of people ask me, well, which one's better? Which, it's not a question of better, it's just which one fits your need. So if you have a camera that doesn't do a down converted 4K signal, it only output 4K, then you want to look at a chameleon because you can take that 4K in and it's, uh, it, it works for you. If you're working with 3D LUTs, if that's important to you, the chameleon will do 3D LUTs, so that's something to factor in. So it's really just a question of seeing which features you need and what's going to work for you in your specific system, and then that's where you make your decision. So just being a little bit more specific, the, the differences between the other two EVFs that Zacuto makes and then the Chameleon, what, what are those? The 4K input, so you can do up to 4K. Uh, and then 3D LUTs, that's the big difference also. And then um, the waveform vector scope, that's a gradical feature that is not available in the, um, in the Chameleon. And those are your, your big differences. And the fact that the Chameleon does both HDMI and SDI is also uh, a big feature. Okay, um, and then you have a you have a sort of list of software features here. I mean, yeah. um, there's a, there there's I mean there's a lot of overlap between there the Gradical EVF. Overlap. and the Yeah, like the the big difference is really is um, as far as the 3D LUTs, which we've mentioned before, and the uh, it can do a four to one zoom on the Chameleon, and then the waveform vector you're missing, and then the multi level focus assist is is not on the chameleon and that's that's a big difference and then also the gradical can do customizable zebras so you can set the level of what zebras you're at whereas the uh, at the uh, chameleon it's just at the traditional like 95 it's just at the one okay so if you already own the the gradical eye then then maybe the chameleon's not something you necessarily need to gravitate to unless you want both HDMI and SDI functionality Correct. Or if, if uh, 3D LUTs are something you're looking to do, 
So is it fair to say that uh, the Chameleon isn't a next generation graticle as much as it's another product for a different user set? Yeah, correct. It is not like we're not, it's not a new improvement and we're not trying to jump up. It's more of like, hey, here's a different product. It's like there's different cameras that work in different spaces. Here's a different graticle that works or a different viewfinder that works in a different space. Great. Well, so you have one in your hand here. Can you show me some of the, uh, the features? Sure. So we've got... You know, rosettes on the side for mounting, it goes on either way. Uh, still got a joystick button so you can do four presets, so whatever features you use all the time. And then a menu button to get in and really tweak it and get it working how you want. Uh, HDMI on the back, and then it has a power four pin limo, and it has a uh, SDI on the bottom. Another thing that we did on our cable is, um, we put a power switch, and I don't know if you can see it here, but it's on the, power switch is on the DTAP connector. So it's nice and simple and it's out of the way, but it still lets you turn it on and off without uh, having to unplug it, which is nice. Um, are those D-taps, I actually really like that feature uh, on a D-tap, is that sold separately is that, or does that only ship with that? No, we actually we make it for the D-tap for both the Gradical and for the, uh, for the Chameleon. And uh, of course, pricing and availability on the Chameleon? So, uh, Chameleon is available now, you can place orders now. We already started shipping, it is at uh, 1950 US list price. And that's what we have. All right, thank you very much, Virg. All right, guys, that's it for us here at the Zacuto booth at NEB 2019. Stay tuned to cinema5d.com for more coverage from the show. Win $5,000 worth of gear in our NEB 2019 giveaway together with Serp and Joby. You can win a Genie 3X's Pro Slider Epic Kit, a Magic Carpet Carbon Fiber Slider, and a Gorilla Pot with Genie Mini. To enter the giveaway, simply click the link below and follow the instructions. All winners will be drawn on April 30th. Good luck and stay tuned to Cinema 5D.